Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error disconnected from Photon. So if you're receiving this error, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to run the game as an administrator. Now this has worked for me, so it might work for you. So make a right click on the game, select manage, click on browse local files. It will take you to the game installation folder, make a right click on the game exe file, select properties, go to this tab and then put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator. So if this is unchecked, put a check over here, hit apply, click on OK and you can launch the game and then you can check it. If that does not work, allow the game exe file to antivirus program. Now for this, you can open Windows settings, go to privacy and security and then click on Windows security and then click on virus and threat protection. Scroll down at the bottom, you will see manage ransomware protection. Click on it. Now click on allow an app through control folder access. Click on yes to allow and then click on add an allowed app. Click on browser apps. Now go to the game installation folder. So in my case, the game is installed in this location. So go to the game installation folder, select the game exe file, click on open. And once the game is added, now type in control panel in Windows search box and then go to control panel, go to system and security, Windows Defender Firewall. Click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Click on change settings at the top. Click on allow another app, click on browse and then go to the game installation folder once again. Select the game exe file, click on open and then click on add. In my case, the game is already added. So once the game is added over here, now you can launch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to turn off, turn on VPN. So uh, for many users, using VPN has worked. So you can use VPN if you can. And if you're already using VPN, then you can just turn it off, close VPN and then check. Check which one is working fine for you. Now the next step is to verify the game files. So make a right click on the game, select properties. Go to install files tab and then click on verify integrative game files. Once the verification is 100% complete, launch the game and then check. Still you are receiving the error, then please follow the rest of the steps shown in this video. So the first step is to restart your computer. So make sure that you simply restart your computer once and after the system restart, launch the game. Next step is to make sure date, time, time zone and region is correct on your computer. So on the bottom right over here, you can see the date and time. Make a right click on date and time, then click on adjust date and time. And make sure set time automatically and set time zone automatically. Both are on over here. So if not on, turn it on and then click on sync now. Make sure that you click on sync now. Now, once this is done, now go to time and language, go to region, language and region, and then make sure right country is selected over here and then launch the game now the next step is to perform power cycle so to perform power cycle shut down your computer first so first of all shut down your computer now once the computer is shut down unplug the power cable from the computer and then after you unplug the power cable press and hold the power button on the computer for a few seconds this will release the static electricity from the computer so after you unplug the power cable press and hold the power button for a few seconds and then turn off your Wi-Fi router. Once you turn off your Wi-Fi router, now wait for a few seconds and then, re then restart your Wi-Fi router. So wait for 10 to 15 seconds and then restart your router. And then plug in the power cable back to the computer and then restart your computer and then launch the game. Next step is to disable manual proxy for this open window settings. Then go to network and internet. Now over here you will see proxy. So if proxy is on over here, turn it off. Next step is to run network troubleshooter for this open window settings. If you have Windows 11, click on system and then click on troubleshoot. If you have Windows 10, click on update and security, then click on troubleshoot. Now click on other troubleshooters. Now find network adapter. And in Windows 10, click on it. Then you will see an option. Run the troubleshooter. In Windows 11, click on run. And once the troubleshoot is complete, restart your computer and then launch the game. Next step is to run this command. These commands are provided in the video description. So copy all the command one by one. By one. Now type in CMD in Windows search box and then Make a right click on command prompt app, then click on run as administrator. Make sure that you're opening command prompt as an administrator. Now click on yes to allow. 
Now paste the command over here, hit the enter key. So copy all the commands one by one, paste it, hit the enter key. Now, once done, make sure that re you restart the computer. So, make sure that you restart your computer. And after the system restart, launch the game. Next step is to perform network reset. Now, before you perform network reset, make sure that you have the Wi-Fi password. Because once you perf perform network reset, it will be asking for your Wi-Fi password. So, make sure that you have the password. So, open Windows settings and then go to Network and Internet. And then in Windows 10, simply scroll down at the bottom, you will find reset option. In Windows 11, click on advanced network settings. And then over here, you can see network reset option. Click on network reset and then click on reset now. Click on yes. And during the network reset, your system will restart. And after the system restart, you can connect to your Wi-Fi. You have to enter your password and then launch the game. Now, next step is to switch to different networks. So if you have different network available, you can switch to different network and then check. Next step is to use Ethernet connection. So if your computer has an Ethernet port and if you have an Ethernet cable, you can use wired connection that will give you stable performance, stable connection. Now, still you're facing the problem, then update your Windows to the latest version. This is important. So make sure that your Windows is up to date. So go to update and security or windows update and then click on check for update. Once all the updates are installed, restart your computer and then launch the game. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.